Hi, my name is Cassie Bonham and I'm a senior here at the Utica Center for Science and Industry and my pathway is multimedia. For my capstone project, when we were introduced it back in junior year, I at first kind of was confused as to what to do because we got total freedom. This was 100% our choice and I kind of tried to think of like my interests and what I thought would be cool in the long run to just hold on to and remember and look back on and I know I love to eat healthy. Growing up my mom had always pushed healthy eating on us and I love that because now I am where I am now and I'm interested in it and I'm interested in learning what foods are good for you and what foods contain GMOs. And when we did the research essay a little while ago, I was so educated. I was very educated on what foods contain GMOs and it's in so much of what we eat on an everyday basis and most people don't even know what GMOs are, which is crazy because genetically modified organisms. I wasn't too sure as to what they were before this project, but after this project I'm very like, I know that has GMOs in it, I'm not going to eat it, like stuff like that and it's really cool because it's really struck my interest. and writing the essay, it was really cool. I learned definitely a lot and I think that it was cool that we did the essay beforehand because it really helped me with my project and kind of what to look for when I'm making recipes and what not to look for and that helps a lot. <clears throat> so this right here is my cookbook. It says Cooking with Cassie, Non-GMO Organic. Um, this is what I created. Um, there's, so there's 30 recipes in here. I wrote on all of the pages for the most part and I wrote like kind of my inspiration for it and um, it just kind of goes on and in a few of the recipes I like would write hand write in something that like a little extra that I would prefer to do like spices as far as that I love to add spices to almost everything very simple things I love spices and um, you can kind of just make it your own only a few challenges that I found myself facing during this project were prices. When I was at the store, non-GMO and organic foods are so much more expensive than your regular foods that contain them. And so buying these things were a little bit pricey. I spent $72 on just two full entree, like all the recipe ingredients for them. And it's quite expensive. Um, and, and planning it out too, I work a lot and it's just it was just hard for me to plan to be home for dinner and things like that and to cook this, the, the prepping. So come summer I will have a lot more time to do this and I'm very excited for it and I can continue to build like I said. But um, I wish that I had more time so that is one downside and the prices too. But besides that I loved this project and I had lots of fun. So that was awesome. Thanks for watching.